Hey everybody, this is Brian from PB Homestead. I want to give you the update for the salad bar LED area. Let me grab the camera and we've got some pretty nice growth on the, uh, the chard this week. Which we'll be likely harvesting for a dinner that Paula is going to make. It's Sunday, so she's going to do some more sauteing. As you can see, these greens are really looking good. Look at that. That is just nice. Nice full chard there. We've got a lot of the green in here, ready to harvest. We already harvested once this week on this, and this is the growth that has come back since that time. So I'm really pleased to see that, because we're gonna be able to harvest off a ton of this. So I got one little bad leaf here, a couple of yellowish leaves, but uh, overall, the amount of green inside of here is really, really exciting to see. And then we've got the beta mix over here. It's coming back. I gave it some more fertilizer, and it seems to be perking up pretty nice. So we'll be able to get some more harvest off of this this week. And then of course this is one of the uh, Yankee Hardy blend that came out of the tent, the mid-sized tent, and was put over here to do our weekly harvest of, you know, just salad green. And so I harvested this uh, last night. So there's still some leaves on here I left long in the center. I took a lot of the stuff from the edge, so that way I could let that regrow and then let this center get uh, a little bit bigger. But uh, I'm pretty happy with uh, the greens we've been getting out of these tents this winter. Because we're getting salads, I mean like, you know, we've had dinner salads with a protein source of like meat or fish mixed with that salad for three, no, four meals this last week. And so you figure I'm providing the base meal four days out of the week with, you know, the addition of some chicken or some, you know, we're not having to eat as high a protein diet we're able to eat more leafy greens that are being produced under our house. And so I figure, you know, that's that's putting a dent in our food bill. So that more than compensates, you know, I, I use that to justify to Paula that the, uh, you know, the electricity that we're spending down here growing this food is now actually paying off in benefits besides just growing some nice tomatoes. I'm actually uh, producing our meals under the house. So that's pretty cool. Uh, the lights are doing well. Haven't had any problems with those. And, uh, I'm pretty happy with this setup I've got here. All right, this has been Brian from P&B Homesteading. I'll talk to you guys again. All right, bye.